Hello and welcome to a tutorial recording uh, um, Cinema 4D facial expressions through postmorphs. Uh, postmorphs are the kind of uh, sliders that you can create any amount you want for any subject you want. And basically, this is my regular uh, regular stance which is zero and then I have morphed which I show you soon uh, so uh, let me just turn off the cloth and actually I can just <coughs> and I have morphed it so it slides all across the hundred uh, these are eyelids eyebrows and so on um, so yeah this is the one uh, Joey's on uh, requested and this is what I rendered Now I'm going to show you how it's... Uh, basically you just create your 3D model uh, using any software. I, I created this model by using ZBrush and here I go. Um, this is the pose without uh, any joints. So it goes uh, it goes to this pose when you select polygons and I go to pose morph. If you don't have pose morph already, uh you can find it in uh, character attacks pose morph. Priority expression enable, yes, of course, base priority expression points. Tax. Here you, uh, when you start, you only have ba base pose. Uh, I'm going to click these ones off and <coughs> I'm going to add pose. Uh, what I'm going to do now is uh, I select the area I want to deform for example eyebrow and I'm going to change brush tool a little bit radius down and I'm going to change it in this way actually it's going to be a um, what I forgot just now. It's going to be a better... Uh, yeah, I have a keyframe on the camera so it keeps popping. Let's go there again and... Okay, so with the control A brush tool uh, surface. So uh, now it doesn't move the other side of the model. And I'm going to do this a little bit. I'm just going to uh, make a qu quick example now and there's the po pose O, this is the one and as you can see it's slideable now and if I were to animate this uh, I'm going to remove all my keyframes okay uh, keyframes and I'm going to set auto key you can manually press con hold control and click here to set strength O the keyframe there and then I'm going to select 30 and put this to 100 and now if I oh, it didn't set it on the zero and Oh, I always remember mode animate. 
zero hundred. And there we go. That's basically it. You can use uh, you can create as many modifiers as you want and you can disable them if you want and if you have something more to uh, some more questions please leave a comment and if you enjoyed this quick tutorial please leave a like and subscribe thank you